I'm making potato soup and what you'll need are 8 to 12 medium sized potatoes, one medium onion, a half teaspoon of garlic salt, a can of cream of mushroom soup, a can of cream of celery, an 8 ounce package of Philadelphia cream cheese, one stick of butter or a half a cup of butter, and a small box of Velveeta cheese, which I don't know if I'll use all that or not, but we'll cube that up. First thing we're going to do is wash and peel your potatoes, and then we're going to cube those up into bite-sized pieces, and we'll do the same with the onion, and we'll let those cook probably about 15 minutes, because it won't take real long for, with them being cut up small like that to cook. I'm making potato soup. And what you'll need is 8 to 12 medium sized potatoes, one medium onion. You want to peel and wash your potatoes. We'll cube them up. And we'll, once you get a, those and the onions put into your crock stock pot, or I've got a Dutch oven I'm using, you'll uh, just fill it with enough water to cover your potatoes and we'll let them cook about 15 minutes and that should get your potatoes done but they won't be real mushy. You also need a half a teaspoon of garlic salt, one can of cream of mushroom soup, a can of cream of celery soup, a small box of pasteurized cheese, I happen to be using Velveeta, and you'll need one I think eight ounce of Philadelphia cream cheese one stick of butter, or if you don't have sticks, just use a half a cup of butter. And you'll need a cup of milk. And so the first thing we're going to do is get these potatoes and the onions sliced up and let them cook. And while they're cooking, we'll cube up our Velveeta so it'll melt faster. Alright, I've, I've got my potatoes and my onions cooking on the stove. And while that's cooking, I'm going to just slice up my Velveeta. Like it. So once the potatoes and the onions done cooking, we'll drain them and then we'll add all these other ingredients. And I'm going to do the same to the Velveeta cheese too. Or the Philadelphia cream cheese. Take it out of its wrapper. And we'll just slice it up too. Alright, I've drained my potatoes and onions, drained the water off. Now I'm ready to add my soups. That, so that was one can of cream of celery soup, one can cream of mushroom soup, stir that a little bit. A half a teaspoon of garlic salt, and a cup of milk, a stick of butter. Stir it up a little bit. And then one eight ounce package of Philadelphia cream cheese and one small pack a uh, small box of Velveeta. Now, you'll want to watch this soup. You don't want to walk off and just leave it because it might stick on you. Now I'm gonna turn the heat on low and once the cheeses and the butter is all melted, it's good to go. It's ready to eat. Uh, it's a delicious soup. I think you'll like it. Uh, some people garnish it with chopped bacon or green onions. So enjoy. You can find this recipe and others at carolseasycooking.com. The butter and the cheeses have all melted. And here's our soup. It smells great. I think you'll enjoy it.